Well, hello. We're back with Hogwarts Legacy. This is our... <clears throat> well, we've made a dozen. This will be our dozenth... Uh, dozenth episode. Um, and uh, you are here in my room of requirement, my undecorated room of requirement. It's just a little barren right now. Um, I don't want to swap out the spells to bother with con conjuring anything at the moment. But um, we can roll up the stairs for a second. I'm here because I was um, getting a variety of things done in here, uh, getting dis my clothing described, etc. And um, since we went to Beast's class last time, it actually turns out that Deke over here, Deke, that Deke, that Deke, um, has a mission for us having to do with a knapsack and um, rescuing rescuing magical beasts. Um, it's really capturing them, but like we're rescuing them from poachers slash, um, whoops, um, whatever, it's fine. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna find fantastic beasts and uh, Deke is gonna show me where. Here we go. I'm ready to learn how to use the knapsack. Perfect, Deke loves an outing. We get to go outside with Deke. Oh, of course there's a loading screen, but, you know, that's that's the way it works. I've been playing off and on. Um, sorry if I rub my head today. My head's been hurting. But i um, been enjoying. Uh, run into lots of little puzzles and done a variety of side missions. I accidentally lied to a woman, told her that her brother had joined the evil side when actually he had died and turned into... And in theory, so I feel like that might even be worse. So I don't really know what a, what the right answer in that thing was. We also helped out uh, Serona a little bit by gathering some long lost things. Just a lot of fetch quests and some puzzles. And um, and I'm rubbing my head because it hurts. And um, but getting a little better at combat, but at the same time I still feel like I'm kind of bad at it. And. Um, yeah, that's that's the update. Oh look, it's that view that we had from last episode. It's so pretty. Time in Deke's life. Deke found himself in service of the cruelest wizard he ever met. Pardon me, sir. A nasty poacher. Deke hated working for him. He did horrible things to beautiful beasts. Oh. It was during those days that Deke first saw a knapsack. Uh, it'll be nice to see one used for good. I feel like I know this voice actor from something. <gasps> Who are we? What are we? Are we Puffkins? Puff? 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 Moles. We have arrived. Deke enjoys coming here to watch the beasts, especially the puffle of puffskins nearby. Puffskins. It will be nice to keep A them puffle safe. of puffs. All you will need to do is get close, direct the open knapsack toward the puffskin, and in it'll go. All right. Puffle of puff. A puffle of puff skeins. Okay, so I I assume that I need to actually equip this. So hang on, let me uh, put it here. Okay, good. Right, you're a cute puff skein. Gotcha. You got one. Where'd everybody else go? They're all gone. I'm sorry I stole you from your family. Rebellion. Oh, there's another one over there. It's going away. No, it you escaped. don't. It escaped. Well, I feel like my puff skein needs a friend, so hang on, hang on a second. Okay, let's go back to Deke. Now we've got two puff skeins. I managed to rescue a puff skein. You can rescue as many as the knapsack will hold. Poachers capture puff skeins and, well, Deke isn't sure what they do with them. Deke is certain they will be safer with you. Now, not all beasts will be as simple to rescue as a puff skein. Deke suggests you next find a beast that can fly. A jobbernal, perhaps. Right. Cabernol. Where would I find one? 
Deep knows of some to the west, nesting in a large tree overlooking Hogwarts. But we must be careful. Deke has seen poachers in the area recently. I'll, I'll kill them Deke all. We'll meet you there whenever <laughs> you're ready. Hmm. Where are we Rebellion. going? Whoops. Do 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 do. Meet Deke in the Jubbernal habitat. There's apparently a glitch where you can surf on your broom across the water. I haven't looked into how to do it. We don't do 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 do. I like how a lot of the music reminds me of number six, which is my favorite after all. And hello, Deke. Hello, Deke. Hello, Deke. Should we continue? Oh, good. Deke was worried about you. What with Incidentally, all the in the area. if for some reason... Perhaps we should work quickly. The Jobbernals are just here in this large tree. If it's helpful, Deke has seen Levioso used to slow flying beasts. Easier to get in close and use the knapsack. <sighs> okay, I'll try and rescue a Jobbernal. Go and rescue a Jobbernal. Good luck. Deke will be waiting. Um, I was going to say, there's a slight possibility of somebody um, coming for maintenance stuff, so if that happens, I'm sorry. Um, okay. How about... Hmm, I don't have a good combination right now. That's Levioso. Okay. Deke hasn't seen this many plants here before. I got you. There we go. Settle yourself. Jabbernol. No home. Jabbernol. Nobberjol. Is there another one? Oh, I can sneak up on them like this. Okay, I have to press it twice. All right, I got two. There, there. I've only kidnapped you. It's fine. You're only a digital animal. You should be proud. I rescued a jobbernal. Deke hopes your jobbernal finds the knapsack nice and cozy. Poachers want them for their feathers, and are not kind when they gather them. Are there any other beasts nearby? Just one that Deke knows of. A herd of moon calves. They Moon live in the cave trees of this footpath. Deke yes, was please. There. All right. Let's definitely find some moon calves. They were the cutest ones in Fantastic Beasts. Ah! I don't know. I don't know what blocks me that way. The edge of the map, maybe. Okay. Let's Hello, talk Deke. to Deep again. Is this the <laughs> Hello, Deep. Mentioned? It is. Moon I said to fly over there. a large tree with the spiral pattern in front, but only under the light of the moon. So, mm. unfortunately, unless you have a way to hasten time, you might sometimes have to wait until nightfall to see them. Ah. <sighs> All right, I'll rescue I him. I don't want to ask then. him how he. Dick will be waiting for I don't. Your I don't ask follow-up questions. The game will take too long. Okay. Alright. It's making sure I know how to do this. Wait. Wait until night time. Okay. Is that them? Rebellion. No, that's a, that's a deer. There's a moon calf. Look at me. Look at me, little moon calf. Let me I got gotcha. you. Rebellion. 
always get two. You uh. do cooperate, won't you? Gotcha. Everything's all. I like rolling my way places. It was a bit trickier than the others, but I have a moon calf now. Another beast, <coughs> open sound. Shame we didn't see the moon calves dancing. It's a marvelous sight. Deke supposes you're finished here. You'll be able to rescue many more beasts, but for now, let's bring the ones you've gathered back to the room. All right. Deke will meet you back in the room whenever you're ready. Now, off he goes. It wants me to return to the room of requirement. I do need to just go do that, because otherwise I'll be very confused what's happening. Mooncalf Den. Aww. Um, yeah, is there anything else we need to worry about? No. I'm right there. If I could just fly in the window, that would make it very handy, but I can't fly in the window, so. In we go. Moon cough. That's when the moon makes you cough. I don't know if I know the voice actor or if the voice acting just reminds me of Wallace from Wallace and Gromit. Oh. Here we are. There you are. Now, we need to show the beast you rescued their new home. But, um, not enough room to let them out here. Imagine all those beasts running amok. That wouldn't do at all. Perhaps if you focus on what your beasts need, the room will provide. I, this has been spoiled for me, but it's pretty mind-blowing. That's that's how how I feel. Hmm. What exactly did you think of? Uh oh. Heavens! You've done it. What? But what is it? Deke isn't sure. I've messed Only up my room. Way to find out. What happened to my desk? <laughs> oh good, okay. There's my desk. Well, my desk is now in a kind of a dumb place, isn't it? Um, well, let's, um, let's fix that real quick. There's stuff to do that way. Um, hmm. No, uh, how do I rotate it? This way. In the slowest way imaginable. Alright, well, it'll be in the way of that part of the room, but I'm not really using that part of the room very much. Okay. Alright, let's go, Deke gonna have to load again. Oh my god! I even knew this would happen and I'm kind of mind blown. Look at this! It's amazing! Where are we, Deke? It seems to be a place for your beasts to live. A vivarium of some sort. Oh, your beasts will be quite comfortable here. They'll live healthy, safe lives. Perhaps you want to release them. Let them see their new home. Okay. Manage beasts, R1. Somehow I manage. Select a beast from the inventory to add. Beasts can be rescued to the highlands. In the highlands. Okay. Uh, I see. Uh, let's just go up to the top. Puff skin. Add. Uh. Oh, we can only add one, apparently. Add. Okay, I copied... I, I got two accidentally. Okay. Hopefully I can add their friends later. 
Oh yeah, because the cutscene wasn't ready for it. <sighs> I'm adorable! Deke thinks the Vivarium will be a fitting new home for your beasts. Indeed. I only hope we'll have enough space for all of them. Deke hopes so too. But if you do run out of room, Madam Peck at Brood and Peck in Hogsmeade will help to find safe homes for them. Any beasts that the room can't hold? Yes, she's well known for helping to care for beasts in need, and she'll give you a fair price for them. Speaking of care, beasts that are well-fed and groomed will provide you with valuable magical materials, such as puffskin hair, for example. If you gather some magical materials from your beasts, Dee can show you how to use them. Very well. I shall let you know when I have some. Ah, oh, it's wholesome, and yet... Well, oddly disturbing. When magical beasts are nurtured, they provide materials, magical properties, beast feed, and beast petting brush are some of the ways to nurture your assigned beast feed and best way of petting brush your spell set. Okay. Alright. Um, that's the brush. The key. Hello, Puffskeen! Alright, hang on. I should be sure. Okay. Hello, Buffskeen! Nope. Yum, 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 yum. Deke's no herbology professor, but some plants here seem to be ready to harvest. I don't know how that works, but let's collect the Buffskeen fur. Great. Okay, so now we know how long that'll take, and now we can add our other friends. Hooray! We may not have wanted to do that, but, you know. Mooncalf! Not mean to do that, Jarvan. <laughs> there we go. I pressed the wrong button. I'm adorable. This will occupy hours of my life if I'm not careful. I'm watching digital magical animals eat digital food so that I can collect digital feathers so that I can brew digital potions. <laughs> well, it's not for potions, it's for weaving it into my clothing, which I honestly don't think I'm going to do much of. Yeah, jobber no. Now I got the jobber no feather. All right. Meanwhile, there's all these magical plants. I can just like harvest this whole Hereabouts. Oh, you didn't get brushed, did you? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> now, why did they have to make them so cute? We're not bothering harvesting the plants right now. You ready? You're so cute, little moon calf. They're so cute! Alright, let's come back with some supplies. I've collected some magical materials, Deke. Now, Deke can show you how to use them. First, you'll need to use this spellcraft to conjure an enchanted loom. An <sighs> enchanted loom? Exactly! It will allow you to use your magical materials to weave magic into the very threads of your clothing, making your clothing more useful in a variety of ways. Why don't you try it? Deke thinks you'll be impressed with what the loom can do. I'll go and experiment with the loom now. Okay, and I can go back to the room of requirements. I love that we don't have to load. That's very helpful. Co collect the swallow meat and things. Might as well. 
Great. Okay. And then we need to... Um, conjuration. Is that conjuring spell? Yep. Gosh, there's, we're running out of space. Alright. Utility. Enchanted loom. Definitely make it black so that it fits with everything. I'm gonna stop making it line up with things. There we go. This does not matter. Add a trait to an item in clothing and upgrade an item in, of clothing. Okay. Uh, magical materials can be used with the loom. New beasts can be rescued. Uh, a new trait can be collected from bandit camps. Okay, except... So I've realized that I need to actually identify something. I don't have anything for this at the moment. Oh, I don't? Okay. I thought I did. Oh, it's locked because I don't have the level. Okay. Um, that already has a trait. Um, this already has a trait, but I don't really need increased damage dealt to cursed targets because I... I'm not cursing targets, so um, add a trait. View traits. Let's increase damage with Incendio. Lovely. A puff skin fur. Eh, a puff skin, whatever. And upgrade. Let's upgrade that same item of clothing. View upgrade. Mooncalf fur. Plus six defense. Uh, upgrade gear. Great. Tell Deke you have used the enchanted loom. That came out nicely. Okay. I should show Deke. I used the enchanted loom. I used the enchanted loom, Deke. Wonderful. Will I be able to weave even more powerful magic into my clothing with the loom? You will. By rescuing even more powerful beasts. For now, however, Deke suggests you explore the vivarium and get to know the beasts you've already rescued. All right. Thank you, Deke. Thank you for your help, Deke. Honestly, I thought the vivarium would like go in in here. So I've put all my stuff in here, but maybe I should move it in into the other into the other area. But I will do that on my own time. Okay, well that was interesting. Um, let's see what's going on um, with other things. Uh, we've got some number of talent points available. I don't know how many. <laughs> um, um, what have we got in the way of quests? In the shadow of the estate. So meeting Sebastian is the next thing we need to do. Um, let's do a side quest. Let's locate this on the map. Because I happen to know that this is close to our our main quest. So let's go here. Um, to Irondale. Am I good? Yeah, let's go to Irondale. <clears throat> well, so now we can kidnap cute animals and put them in the room of requirement the, the 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 countryside inside the room of requirement ah. splashed my water but I didn't knock it over could have been a lot worse I moved the electronics away from it ah. doopy doopy doop doop doopy doop doop do doopy doopy doop 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 do. So this side quest was some lady, I'm so tired, some lady in Irondale was like, it's fascinating, it's just so fascinating, and you talk to her and she's like, it's fascinating, and then she explains that, oh my gosh, um, let's make it daytime, 
Should we? Let's make it daytime. It seems... This seems... I can't see anything and... Okay, there we go. Rebellion. Oh, we can steal from this person if we can figure out how to get into their house. Yeah, it's a level 2 lock, so I, I have to go collect things before I can... Ooh, that looks like a T-Rex foot. Hello, nice to meet you. Hello. Uh, hello. Hello. My name is Paul Rick Haggerty, and this is my shop. W what may I help you with? I'd, I'd like, like to, to buy things. Your shop, if you don't mind. Oh my god, Certainly, no, I... Certainly, that'd be fine. What would you like to know? <sighs> what are these questions? What do you sell? How long have you lived here? Have you ever visited the Goblin Mine? No, I just want to see would what he sells. Sell? He sells... Ooh, various, various ingredients. If I can't find animals, I can buy them from here. Okay, that's fine. Um, I thought I had more things to sell, but apparently I don't. So we'll sold, we'll sell the gold it's, dragon uh, something spectacles. Why? Okay. Oh, and we got ourselves a Merlin trial. Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. Alright. Um, there's one. There's two. Rebellion. Where is the third? Um... There's usually more than more than two. Places. Oh, whoops. Confringo. Yeah, Rebellion. there's usually more than two, and you have to get somewhere where you can kind of see them all from. Ooh, a rainbow! <gasps> That's so pretty. Uh, it is not what we were doing though. There's one. There it is. Alright, can I see it from here? I can see that one from here. Can I see this one from here? Just barely. I have to run. But that's okay. Uh, I that's not so good. Let's try that again. Uh... It'll, it'll reset itself. I think that's how this works. Rebellion. Oh my gosh. And then we gotta get over to this one. I was just a bit too short. would be proud. I did it. I know I was trying to do something else, but we walked right past it. And I've been doing these types of things, and now I've gotten better at them, so now you get to do them with me. Alright. Excuse me, sirs. Nobody's phased by this. I wonder if I'm safe to explore in there. Where? What are you talking about? Is this a cave? I don't know what he's talking about. Um, I don't know. We'll find out another time. Okay. I'm just following the thing. Ooh! What's that meter up at the top? I don't understand this, this meter. Like the statue Madam Twiddle mentioned. Oh, I have to attack 20 of these things? Okay. Destroy the vases. I assume. Why am I destroying vases? My this is just my instinct. I have to try to find all the vases. It 
some of these uh I think there should only be a few more vases. Somebody's car alarm's going off. Revelio. Okay, here's two more. And then there's one back there. I'm nearly finished. One more of ours. Okay, just had to destroy some pottery. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. That's it. Let's go I talk tell to Madam it. Twiddle about what happened. Battle arena. Well, I have to hit start. What am I battling? Oh my gosh. What does this do? South Coast Battle Arena. South Coast Battle Arena. Holy cow. I wonder what I'm fighting. Oh, hello. Whoops. I pressed the wrong button. And... Okay, let's throw an exploding barrel at him. And then let's hit him with a... Dark magic? Ancient magic. Let's just ancient mag magic him. And let's just ancient magic him. This is only wave one, though. I don't feel that I'm going to do very well. Ow. I'm going to use all of my stuff, aren't I? Alright. Okay. Oh. You're supposed to be able to flip Hendo them when they try to hit you. Let's try this again. Come and hit me again. Come on. Oh my god. Alright, I'm dying because I'm trying to do fancy things. Okay. Incendio. Okay. That was the first wave. Wave number one. This is now wave number two. How many waves are there? Ow. Okay. There we go. Oh. Okay. Wave number two. What's wave number three? Uh, what, what's... Oh, well, that was not what I meant to do. Okay, well, whatever, fine. Okay, let me get you. The duck bog. He 
these dug bugs are really nailing me. And like at you. Okay, let's incendio the the spider. Let's get the spider, please. And and throw a thing at a duck bog. And you. Ow. Okay, let's get this duck bog, shall we? Let's just kill it. There we go. Okay, Glacius you, and then Defendo you. Uh, you're the problem, aren't you? What is hitting me, by the way? Um, let's get you. Okay. Okay. Okay, Expelliarmus is not very good against the spider. Okay, that was a hard wave. Do we get more waves? Oh, just one. Oh. Oh, we got four monsters. There's a fighter troll. Okay. Uh, ancient magic patrol for a sec. Just the troll remains. Oops, that hurt. Okay, let's hit you with one of these. Okay, getting somewhere. Oops, Defendo is not recharged yet. Okay. Ah, so Fl Flipendo does nothing. I was lied to. Oh, I did it. Okay, you have to do it after. That makes sense. Completed. 
took me... Oh, final wave. Okay. Uh, why is my button not working? There we go. I don't really know who I'm dealing with either. Who are you? We're just dealing with the trolls. Oh. Oops, that didn't work. What's happening with those assassin armored armor guys? Maybe I have to beat the trolls? Maybe I can use the trolls to smash the dudes. I'm running out of potions. Let's get you. Oh my god, we still got more. Oh! There we go. Okay. Okay. Woohoo! Give me this. Okay. I think I have to kill the trolls. I think because I think the other guys just keep coming. Get out of here. All right, let me try to kill the troll then. Oops. Let me try to get this one. Whoops. What did I do wrong? Whoops. Now what did I do wrong? Okay. Okay. Oops. Okay, let's place this. Alright, and... Defend 
Okay. Kill it. Good. Charge me. This dodge isn't always working. I think I'm having issues with the dodge. And... Come on. Got the armor troll. I will make it. Oops, that wasn't what I meant to do. Ow. Okay, you, come here. Ow. Thank you. Last one. Petrificus Totalis. Totalis. Oh my gosh. We did it, and we didn't die. Let's return to the highland. Dun dun dun. Return to the highlands. <whistles> I drank like all of my potions. I'm gonna have to go on a Wiganweld cooking spree. Ooh. Hopefully, um,. We're not going to have a big battle in Sebastian's story mission. Sorry if I wasn't talking very much. I was concentrating. That was challenging. But satisfyingly challenging. I'm glad I'm I'm glad the difficulty's picked up a bit though cuz I was I was sort of obliterating things for a bit there. But that's just the encounters you have out in the woods. The, like, the actual hard fights are a bigger deal. Ooh, there's a new quest available. What's the new quest? Apparently destroying all the bases activated statues. Return to Madame Twiddle and confirm her husband's suspicions. Alright, and then she can twiddle her thumb. work on my upgrades another time let's find Madam Twiddle she's over here twiddling her thumbs I already made that joke we this has not rendered in okay there we go <laughs> crashing into the ground that's fine let's we don't tell him what lies in wait for me in there where <laughs> I don't know what he's talking about hello Mrs. Twiddle, your husband was right. The statue was part of a puzzle. Oh, really? How exciting! You just had to break yes. everything. I had to destroy a number of large vases, and that seemed to activate some sort of charm on the statue. Those were my grandmother's well, vases. Oh, I miss having someone like you around with a thirst for knowledge and a quick mind. Well, my curiosity has been satisfied. Thank you for that. Who knows what I'll encounter on my next constitutional. I don't know what a constitutional oh, my is. My husband would be so pleased to know he was right about that statue. Okay, that's nice. Alright, let's... Where is the map? There it is. Okay, we're tracking that quest. In that place. And we're gonna get that there fire pit. This is pretty. Oh, wow. That's nice. Do 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 do
think this is a battle. Whoops. Okay, that wasn't Your too bad. On Ranrock's hands. Well, I mean, it's kind of on mine, like... Rebellion. <laughs> okay, let me in. What's this? Oh, it's a puzzle. Okay, hang on. Um, Rebellion. Some things. Uh, well, we're here. Still for me this time. We'll put the swallow meat on, but I uh, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this. Maybe flipendo. Flipendo. No. Maybe. Maybe. No. Maybe Accio. Maybe. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do with these. They do seem like they're interactable, unlike some of the other things. Hmm. Oh, hang on. Uh, I've gotten sidetracked again. Lumos. No. Well, I'm kind of out of spell ideas. Accio. Maybe Wingardium Leviosa? Yeah, no, I don't know what to do with that, but I don't want to figure it out while I'm recording. I'll do that another time. Let's go find Sebastian and sort this thing out. Ooh, it's down there. <laughs> I can't. I can't stay on task. It's impossible. What else we got? Anything? Not much. You guys didn't have much. Alright. There's probably something in here. Maybe. There it is. I'm getting... That means I got a... Um, collection. Let's see what I got. Yeah, I might have got a wand handle. Alright. Column beige. Yeah, I don't really like any of the wand handles. It's not that they are not, like, well made or anything like that. It's just... They just don't fit my... My interests. Oh, and that, um... Sorry, I just noticed I'm level 24. So that means that, um... The thing I couldn't wear is now unlocked, whatever it was. Headwear, maybe? No. Oh, that is headwear. There we go. Yeah, we're gonna replace the fur-lined cap with a periwinkle top hat. <laughs> Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. All right, uh, let's take that off, please. <laughs> and do I want to talent upgrade? I could make Defendo better. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait and see what I get from hanging out with Sebastian. Actually, does it tell me what I get from hanging out with Sebastian? No. 
All right, we're finally going to meet Sebastian in Feldcroft. It's almost been an hour, and we haven't done the like. Well, no, we went and we we did a story mission. We went and did the uh, the Deke thing. We 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 figured out how to rescue Poof Soufflés or uh, whatever they're called, Periwinkles, Puff Schemes, and Moon Calves. Moon pie flavored too, and uh, was the other one S -s sparrow, sparrow hawk. That's a that's not it. Gosh, there's a lot of these. Oh, hello. So Defendo is stronger than Confringo, but um, it has a longer cooldown time, and I'm not very good at managing cooldown times. Was that in the game? I don't know what that was. There's lots more balloons to pop. And you may use this balloon to fly to a new world. Oops. They're getting attacked by spiders. No! Does this get me anything to do these? I don't know. Revelio. Treasure go. Cursed fiends. Cursed fiends. Curses. Revelio. Where did the treasure go? There it is. <laughs> Got to roll. All right. And there were plants I could collect too. Yeah. This gets me lily swing flies. Wait, can I... hang on. Okay. Okay, it's not a magical beast, so I can't fly on it. That's That answers my question. I mean, I can't fly on it. I can't, uh... Um... collect it. Doing this sort of thing forever, Fancy I'll have my own operation. Okay. Still ended up here at night. Wait. See, I, I knew we would need to be here in the daytime. Whoop, whoop, you whoop. Made it. I did, pardon me. I've been waiting here all night for you. All right, Sebastian. Enjoying the view. Keeping an eye on things. Feldcroft isn't what it used to be. No one has felt safe here since Ranrock's loyalists took a peculiar interest in that castle over there. Rookwood Castle. My uncle Solomon is a former Aura and refuses to look into it. Even after Anne was cursed by one of them. Possibly Aww. with a wand, no less. I heard a goblin refer to wizard kind as wand carriers. A goblin's forbidden from carrying wands. Precisely. That's why I'm on the hunt for answers. If I'm to cure her, I need to understand what happened to her. Anne was always the most mischievous of the three of us. Which is saying something, knowing <laughs> me and Ominous. I'm hoping a surprise visit from me and a new friend from Hogwarts will help lift her spirits. Bring back the Anna I used to know. Come on. 
I'll take you to my own. But uncles. you didn't have to cut me off. Make it like it never this happened way. and that we were nothing. Alright, this way. You treat me like a wizard and it feels Felt so Croft used to be a lot livelier. With Ranrock's lot wandering about all the time, everyone stays out of sight. Here we are. It's going to teach me a My spell, I can tell, because there's inside. dummies. Alright, in we go. We're going to meet the sister. Enter. I'm actually very curious to meet the sister. Aha! Sebastian, where did you... Is that what I think it is? We've been over this, boy. Hey. Shrivel figs cannot reverse a curse. Nothing can. The sooner you accept that reality, the better. But we have well, where to go? Everything. There is no cure! When will you accept that? Never! I can never accept it! <laughs> Now look what you've done. Oh boy. I gotta deal with this guy. I'm sorry you had to see that. If you don't mind, I just need a moment alone. Yeah, no problem. Poor Sebastian. Not the visit he died for. Speak with Anne and Solomon. I'm gonna talk I'm to them. Sorry about earlier. Those bouts of pain are difficult to bear. Are you all right, Anne? I didn't mean to intrude. You didn't, truly. <laughs> and I'm all right. The pain from this curse comes in bouts, and often suddenly. It's not anyone's fault. It's nice to meet you, by the way. You must be the new fifth year Sebastian told me about. I am. Sebastian I am and I Adrian Maxwell Travell in defense against the dark arts. Oh dear Professor Hecket. She's a powerful witch. And she knows how to keep students like my brother and me in line. I do miss Hogwarts, but I wouldn't mind being in Feldcroft really if it wasn't so dreary now. Between the goblins at the castle and my uncle fighting with Sebastian whenever he's home. It's not the cozy retreat it once was. Sebastian mentioned something about your uncle being an ex-Aura, but refusing to go after Ranrock's loyalists. I must say, I wasn't prepared for him to be as angry as he was. Uncle Solomon is frustrated by what happened to me, and by Sebastian for thinking he can fix it. They both mean well, I know they do, but my uncle is right. This curse cannot be undone. I can feel it. Sebastian cannot take away my pain. Perhaps you can help him to understand that. <sighs> I'll do my best. I can promise to speak with him about it. Thank you. His search for a cure is futile, I'm afraid. I'm getting tired. I should probably rest. Thank you for stopping by. Okay. I wish you well. Just trying to figure out potions. Okay, I'm reading their letters. All right, Anne, we're gonna sort this out. I'm gonna eat one of your apples. Yep. Makes me remember that we have apples over there. I need to eat those. Revelio. Deal with that, that later. boy will fray my last nerve. Excuse me, Mr. Sallow. <laughs> oh, yes, Sebastian's friend. I apologize on behalf of my nephew. He doesn't know when to stop. I was about to check on Anne. Did I see you come from the house? How is she? She's all right. She said she was going to rest. Nothing can be done for her. I'm gonna make him angry. I understand you've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mungo's to no avail. 
We have. My nephew thinks he knows better than the healers. Perhaps the healers don't know everything, sir. Sebastian is single-mindedly focused on finding a way to help his sister. If there is a cure, he will find it. Your faith in Sebastian is misplaced. Some sort of dark magic cursed Anne. And the goblins aren't likely to explain themselves any time soon. Giving her hope is cruel. The only thing to do now is keep Anne comfortable and stay out of the Loyalists' way. Hope could be a good thing. I don't want to make him angry. With all due respect, sir, hope could keep Anne's spirits up. You may mean well, but I know what's best for Anne and Sebastian. They are my stubborn brother's children. Especially Sebastian. If you really want to be of help, you'll make sure Sebastian does what he should do, not what he wants to do. He's no idea the harm he could do if he doesn't stop. Mm. I hope you'll remember Rebellion. what I said. Good day. I ought to see how Sebastian's faring. Why will he not listen to me? She's He's my a sister. Jerk. How are you doing, Sebastian? You got a first-hand glance at what I'm dealing with. I apologize for my uncle. I'll admit, I wasn't expecting him to be so angry. He's always angry. He's been angry since my parents died. After Anne was hurt, he only grew worse. Mm. It's as though he blames me somehow. Always calling me my father's son. As if that's an insult. I'm the one trying to help her. He's simply given up. Both Anne and your uncle seem genuinely convinced that nothing more can be done for her. I refuse to believe that. Anne's pain is more than physical. It has changed her entirely. I miss my sister. And I'm going to get her back. Come with me. I need to show you where it happened. Yes, please. Ranrock's loyalists are capable of so much more than people realize. They should not be underestimated. Yeah. All the I debris have... you'll see is from whatever's going Rebellion. on in the family estate. They've been digging for something. <laughs> I managed to get it while I was underwater. Ouch. Need to take break in. They've been digging for something, huh? Do you stop? Up there, oh, okay. on that plateau, is where they cursed Anne. The, you this just way. live just down the hill? You didn't move away? Okay. Hang on just a second. I feel we might want, um... That. There we go. Just a feeling. Rabble. Ram Rock knows what he's doing. It's an honor to be a part of it. A good wizard is a dead wizard in my book. Ha! I didn't touch your hell. Akio. I won't rest. Carry on. Now listen. Can bring up. Incendio. Oops. Good. You will regret. Ah, there you are. I think I will. Oh, not, not you. Okay, do you have a wand? What's going on with you? Okay, that, 
They're coming. Thank you for getting that. That was good. Okay. Good. All right. What else? Your last mistake. Ah. Ow. Rather unwise coming back anyway. Let's get this over with. Good. All right. There we go. <laughs> I confess, that was a bit more than I bargained for. I tried to warn you. Well, yeah, I mean, I expected that. That's why we, that's why we're here. Uh, does that do something for me? That I can repair that? <laughs> Rebellion. Like, give me that beast thing back in case I run into a uh, into a beast. Into a fantastical beast. Alright, he tried to warn me. Alright. Ouch. Those loyalists deserved what they got. Couldn't agree more. This is where it happened. We smelled smoke in the middle of the night. When we looked outside, flames were shooting from the estate. Before my uncle and I could stop her, Anne rushed out, racing towards the fire. Worried someone would be hurt. Mm. She came face to face with a horde of goblins, frantically trying to stamp out the flames. Suddenly, an icy voice drifted out from somewhere in the smoke. Children should be seen and not heard. A blinding blast followed. They didn't even give her a chance to run. It seems an awfully violent response to a child wandering by. What were they trying to hide? My thoughts exactly. It may be grasping at billywigs, but I keep thinking that there might be something here that could lead me to whoever cursed Anne. Might be the only way to learn what type of magic harmed her, which could help me find a cure. Dark Perhaps you're right. magic. The loyalists are everywhere, but they like do seem to be spending a lot of time here, and it's likely they're hiding something. And at Rookwood Castle. Shall we have a look around? Yes, please. They seem to have set up camp here for a specific reason. They have stations for everything. Revelio. Okay, what is this? Whose home was this? Been abandoned long since I've lived here. Rumor was a Hogwarts professor lived here once, centuries ago. But that's all I ever heard. I've heard that goblin dig sites like these are popping up everywhere. Hmm. It's a wonder the Ministry isn't doing more. Always armed and ready for a fight, Ranrock's loyalists. Revelio. It might be worth taking a closer look at how Taking a closer look at what? Didn't hear what he said. This well looks familiar. Sebastian, I've seen this before. This house, the well, the view. What time? Mm. When? This is the... Give me a moment. I'll explain in a second. 
Wow. This is the place. Oh my gosh, this is the place that was having a drought, and they stood up here. Or they stood up there. This is where... Yeah, okay, this is getting connected. This is where the 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 one the other one who had the power who gets creepy the creepy witch that i keep saying is evil this is where she lived this is where her brother died and then up there somewhere was where uh the faculty came and brought rain to the drought okay it's starting to connect revelio Um, what else can we see? Anything else? Just gonna check, because I think that's gonna set it off. A chest! Yeah, yeah, there we go. Purple dragon-eyed spectacles. What a spectacle. Sebastian, over here. Do you think that this was damaged by the fire the night that Anne was cursed? Could be. But it looks to me as though this was intentional. Yeah. Somebody didn't like this portrait. They didn't want her to talk to them. Sebastian, this house did belong to a Hogwarts professor hundreds of years ago. Who? What do you I found a pensive that day in the restricted section with a memory that showed this house. There was a little girl and a drought. The keepers have shown me other memories as well. The girl became a Hogwarts professor. Her name was Isadora Morganock. She was one of the keepers. The keepers? Like in Quidditch. And you found a pensive in the library. That's what I said. I'm not following you. I realize it's a lot to take in. I'm not even sure I understand it all yet. And no, not like Quidditch. They call themselves Keepers because they're protecting some type of knowledge. It has to do with the Vault at Gringotts. Let me see if I've got this straight. You have Ranrock and Rookwood after you because of something you found at Gringotts where you ended up via a port key. You can see traces of an ancient magic that you think Ranrock is trying to harness. And now you've been witnessing memories left by keepers. Oh, and this house belonged to a Hogwarts professor who was one of these non-Quidditch keepers hundreds of years ago. If now I you're getting it. You, I think you were pulling my leg. It is all a bit much, isn't it, when you put it like that? The point is, we both have good reason to search this house. You for answers about what happened to Anne, and me for answers about the keepers. Look at mm -hmm. this. Someone piled this here for a reason. Is it blocking something? Only one way to find out. Revelio. Aha. Uh -huh. Down we go. Lumos. All right. Why You're ready? blocking a stairwell? There might be something here worth a closer look. They've left all of this simply strewn about tells me they're after something bigger. I can't use... Oh, Isadora Mog Morganach journal entry. I traveled here to learn, but I long to help. My internal struggle is overwhelming. It's as though the magic wants to heal, and I am the one preventing it from doing so. Should I lose hope? Will I forever regret not having done more? I cannot look into their eyes, knowing that I could lessen the burden of heartache. I saw the man leaving camp today, the one who so reminded me of my father. Surely it wouldn't help, hurt to help him. I could further my research, of course, but that would be a fortuitous consequence of doing something good with this ability. Seems these journal entries are from Isadora's travels. Can we get to the other side? I don't think we can. Um, hang on. Okay, that doesn't work. Lumos. Okay, I thought maybe I could vanish those chairs, but it just happens to be the same. Um, what do we do? How can we? 
Oh, I just have to read the next thing. It is my second week in the camp. More arrive each day. The muggle doctors and even some of our own healers are doing all they can for them. The grief is palpable. The ones who have survived the plague are forever damaged by their loss. My fever may, fever may pass. The skin may mend and scar, but the devastating sorrow remains. I think the thing is right. Power to help these souls. Arbitrary to not help them as it would be to rid them of their torment. A journal entry of Isadora's. I should hold on to this. I am exploring the cellar. Explore the cellar. Revelio. Confringo. No, that's not what I meant to do. Lumos. Um. Can I just jump? Oh. Oh, there's a mirror back there. This mirror is dirty too. Uh. Can I get through? Yeah. Okay. There we go. <laughs> I feel very silly now. Lumos. All right. You're not going to believe this. I can see the Undercroft. What? A daydream? Because that happens to me too. <laughs> no. <laughs> As in, we can teleport there. I know it sounds strange, but honestly, I nothing you say sounds strange to me anymore. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> I can see the Undercroft through this stone wall, as though it's a window. This has happened before. I'm listening. I think it's to do with my ability to see traces of ancient magic. But you said you didn't really understand it, and that you couldn't wield it. That's true, and I'm still not sure what it all means. What I do know is that my ability allows me to travel through these windows I see. Wait. We can get straight to the Undercroft from here. Ominous will be flawed. We can. But perhaps best not to tell anyone else about this for now. Even Ominous. Understood. Well then, invisible secret ancient magic passageway? Here we come. All right. I'm tempted to hold my breath. Here we go. And we got a load of Hogwarts. I thought there was a suspicious stone wall. Is it? Why would the door lead us here? Sebastian, look. Triptych. We have to find the paintings. And a map. Somebody ripped the map Why out. Why the triptych here? Seems as if something's missing. Yeah, the mm. paintings. Let's have a look. Ah. Rune diagram. A rune diagram. These are all the symbol of the game. Anything helpful in the notes? It's a rune diagram. A rune symbol. I've seen similar symbols used by the Keepers. I've been thinking. A Keeper lived in that house centuries ago, and Ranrock and his lot have been searching there. You said that goblins may be wielding some form of this ancient magic. Do you think Anne was cursed by ancient magic? I can't be sure, of course, but I don't think so. I didn't see any traces of it around your sister. Yeah. Mm. Very well. But that doesn't mean it's not ancient magic. It's true. There's still so much we don't know about it. True. Mm -hmm. Perhaps this triptych will lead us to answers. Then we'll have to unravel what this all means. But now I need to see Ominous. Don't worry, I won't tell him anything. Did I mention that, apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here, in Hogwarts? You did not. Sounds worth looking into. 
Any idea where in the castle? No idea. Ominous just learned of it. I'll let you know what I find out. What's a scriptorium? I have no idea our visit to Sian would unfold into all of this. My head's an utter mess. But I'm glad you told me everything you did. I'll be in touch. I'll be Till in then. touch. Okay. Fascinating. All right, now where to? Are we going to get some mail? Mail? New quest available. Open quest log. I got to stop either way, but... <gasps> astronomy class! Well, next time we will go to astronomy class. Um, yep, thank you very much. And uh, what's my new spell combination going on here? What do I got? Meet me near the ruins oh. of Falbatten Castle. After dark. Do not tell anyone. <sighs> um, okay, now we also have that. Which do we do first? We do the one with the lower level requirement. Astronomy class. Okay. Professor Sean's class is at the top of the astronomy tower, upstairs from the entrance to the room of requirement. I should head there now. And I will. But anyway, uh, what I was trying to say is, until next time, and... Uh, there's something about Flipendo and... 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 Uh, goodbye. Uh, maybe... I don't know. <laughs> uh, I can't think of a pun. All I can think of is flippendo no. Goodbye.